recently launched two businesses in two years and found a way to power through the pandemic. Not easy to do, but you might know them as Uncle D's Takeout and the Grey Goose of Grandin. Alyssa Ray checks in with Dan and Karen Curtis on how family is fueling their success. Last year during his retirement, Dan Curtis knew it was time to pursue his lifelong dream. I was in the golf business for 35 years and uh, it was always a passion of mine to, to open a restaurant. That's when Uncle D's Takeout was born, but don't let the name fool you. We do have five tables and we encourage people to come in here and eat, but it's in the name so everything leaves the kitchen in a bag. From Italian favorites to country comforts, the menu has a little something for everybody, but the pandemic caused some speed bumps for this small business. It was very difficult in COVID from staffing to um, supply. Customers were just very leery about going up. Dan isn't the only one in the family who recently launched his own business. Across town, his wife Karen runs the Grey Goose of Grandin. Karen also has been dealing with COVID issues since she opened shop in 2020. It's been a challenge because I'm a one man band and so when I'm exposed I have to close. In two years, one family launched two small businesses and with the help from their daughters and each other, Karen and Dan have overcame plenty of obstacles. And I fill in when his folks over there that work have COVID. I've filled in a few shifts, so I'm the I'm the salad girl. <laughs> they say it takes a village to start a business, but in this case, it takes a family. In Roanoke, Alyssa Ray, 10 News, working for you.